Today we will work together with another interesting technique in Chaos Vantage software. This tutorial is about animated camera. Do you want to have the cameras and animations you made in Chaos Vantage in 3ds Max? Watch this tutorial till the end. At the end of this video, we will mention some points that you must know. Hello, welcome to MIMVIS. Transferring animated cameras from 3ds Max to Chaos Vantage is very simple, and we all can do it easily. It is enough to activate the Export Animation section only when exporting and then export. But this is not the subject of our training. In this video, we want to transfer the cameras and animations we made in Chaos Vantage to 3ds Max. But why should we do this? Let's start the tutorial and discuss the reasons along the way. Here we have one of the scenes of the CG Trader Company, which has only one main camera, and we want to take a look at the file in Chaos Vantage software and in live mode and create new shots and animations very quickly. So we click on the Live Link option to open the file. You can see that the scene was opened without any problem in Vantage. We can check it with Navigate. In the camera section, we see that there is only the main camera. Now we start creating new shots with specific names. We create another angle from above. We try to change the parameters for each camera to check everything. For example, here we use a wide lens. And in the second camera, we use a telephoto lens and go back a little and activate clipping. Next, we add our shots to the animation bar and determine the movement time between these shots. Obviously, our animation is created. So here, we created several shots and animations very quickly. But in live mode, we cannot save the file and use it later. So we have to transfer all shots and animations to 3ds Max. And this is the most important and practical reason for using this technique. Let's do it. It is very simple. Just exit the live mode and save your Vantage file. Go back to 3ds Max and select the Import Changes from Chaos Vantage option in the Chaos Vantage bar. In the opened window, select Camera and Animated Camera options and finally select Import. In this step, we must select our Vantage file. If we go to the list of cameras, you will see that all the cameras have been added with their names. Animated cameras are also featured. Just go to the desired camera and play the player. We can see that the animation has been imported completely correctly. We saw that we easily transferred our cameras and animations from Vantage to 3ds Max. Well, let's go to the promise we made and review the points of this tutorial together. The positive and attractive point of this feature is the transmission of most camera parameters. Also, all the items that are red can be animated. We can see that here the depth of field is changing during the animation. 
The first problem of this technique is the problem in importing clipping in Max. And then you have to set the numbers according to your needs. The next negative point that we must mention is that this function does not work in viewport recording in Chaos Vantage. It would be very interesting if we could walk in the scene and access that camera in 3ds Max. In general, this technique is very attractive to me because I can make my animations faster in live mode and everyone can have their own reasons for using this ability. Thank you for being with us in this tutorial. Don't forget to like, comment, and sub to support us. Bye, until the next tutorial.